I recently signed up for Mint Mobile's $5 starter kit. This is a $5 kit to try out Mint Mobile, test their network, see what the coverage is like in your area. And from signing up for this kit, what I learned is Android phones require custom APN settings to get certain features to work. This includes group messaging, picture messaging, and cellular data. So in this video, we are going over the APN settings and how to enter them on your Android phone to get those features to work. The first step is to make sure you have a Wi-Fi connection because of course your data is not yet set up. If I jump into my wireless settings, you can see I am connected to our wireless network called Roadrunner. The next step is to go into your preferred internet browser. I actually prefer Chrome and uh, go to Mint Mobile's website and they'll have a page which I'll have linked in the video description where you can see the correct APN settings for your Android device. APN stands for access point name and all we're gonna be doing is entering these settings into our Android phone, again, to make features like group messaging, picture messaging, and cellular data work properly. So the next step is to jump into settings. So you can tap this gear icon. You're gonna to go to connections. You're gonna to go to mobile networks, access point names, and we're gonna click add in the top right, or I guess tap. The name is going to be Ultra with a capital U. The APN is Wholesale with a capital W. And uh, let's go back and see what the other settings are. So we're going to leave proxy blank. The port is 8080. Username and password we're going to leave blank. Server we're going to leave blank. MMS, we're going to type in this link. Paste that right in there. OK. Let's go back. The MMS proxy is going to be blank. The port is blank. The MCC and MNC, 310 and 260, we can go back. I'm actually seeing those numbers entered correctly already on my device, so that is all set. Authentication type, leave blank. And APN type, default, comma, supple, comma, MMS. I'm just going to copy this. And APN type, I'm just going to delete everything that's in here and paste that in. Okay, so with that done, that is everything we need to do. We're just going to go up top, tap the three vertical dots, tap save, and because I think I already have it, it didn't show up. What happened to me the first time I did this is the first one was selected. I actually just want to tap on the second one. And once the second one is selected, the one you just created that says Ultra, you just want to go back home and hold the power button to restart your device. Once your device restarts, you're done. Group messaging, picture messaging, and cellular data should now all be configured properly. One thing I was noticing is when I went into the messages application and I was testing out group messaging, you can see I was getting a really annoying subject, no subject message before each one of the messages I received. To fix this, I found if I just went into the Play Store and I searched for messages, Google makes their own messages application that is available on all Android devices. So went over here, messages, I installed it. And then when I opened it, I could tap next, change it to my default messaging app. And now when I jump in to the same group conversation, you can see all of those subject messages are now fixed. And that was really the only thing I noticed. Everything else is working properly and you should be all set and ready to go. There you go, that is how you enter Mint Mobile's custom APN settings on your Android phone to get features like group messaging, picture messaging, and cellular data working properly. If you found this video helpful, leave it a thumbs up down below and subscribe for more videos like this one. I'm Stetson, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.